I just want to point out that what this whole uh, aggression against Iran is based on is the idea that Iran is going to make nuclear weapons. The U.S. has the second is, is the second uh, how should I say this? the second country in the world with the most uh, nuclear weapons. The only other country that has more nuclear weapons than us is Russia, and they're probably not sure where half of those are. <laughs> we go on and on about how Iran is a threat to the world, about how we have to stop them, about how we have to stop all these countries who are a threat to the world, but who's really a threat to world peace? The U.S. has invaded more countries in the last 50 years than any other country in the world. Fine. They don't tell you that a million uh, Filipinos died at the beginning of this century because we wanted to deny, deny them their independence. One million. They don't tell you that three million Vietnamese died because we wanted to deny them their right to self-determination. A million dead Iraqis. How many more millions of people have to die before we stop imperialism? <laughs> And about the idea of the nuclear weapon. The U.S. is the only country in the world to have ever dropped a nuclear bomb on a civilian populace. And they did it twice. Nice. Yeah. I've been to Nagasaki and I've seen the exact point where we dropped that bomb on that city. A city full of kids and women and children and people just going about their daily lives. Not soldiers, not ships, not tanks. Innocent civilians. And over a hundred thousand of them died instantly from that atomic bomb. There was absolutely no reason for it. So how can the only country in the world who's ever used a nuclear weapon on a civilian populace and done it twice tell any country what they can and can't do? Thank you. Exactly. Woo!